It's April and May, our peak storm season. It's not over yet. It's hard uh, to dry out when you've had precipitation 10 of the first 13 days of May, like you see in the calendar behind me. But for the same reason, we've got a lot of mosquitoes, same reason we've had a lot of pollen in the air, same reason we've had really good looking gardens. We've had about double the amount of rain we typically get in the spring. The last freeze was in mid February. It's the seventh warmest, but uh, spring so far, but it hasn't been hot. We've only had two 90 degree days, and it's the ninth, ninth wettest spring on record so far, with more rain on the way before the week is done. We've had some rain around today, not at DFW. It was officially a dry day, but you see those thunderstorms out in Wood County. That's the last of the thunderstorm activity that got fired up by the cold front that came through across the evening. There was some really uh, big rains with that. Uh, but it was all off to the east of the Metroplex. There's a live look looking down at Dallas, looking west under clear skies. Got up to 84 today, 65 was the low. That's pretty much average for this time of year. And like I said, uh, for once, no rainfall at the DFW airport. Let's talk about bus stop weather. Temperatures will start in the 60s. You send them out the door, mostly sunny skies. A sunny day in store for us, mid 80s by 3 o'clock. Uh, here are the next three days. We'll be uh, 86 tomorrow for a high and 90 for a high on Wednesday with a 30% chance of rain showing up overnight and then that 70% chance of rain on Thursday and upper 70s. That might be early in the day. It might be cooler than that in the afternoon because of the rain we're expecting. As we can see, that's a 30% overnight, a 70% during the day, and a 40% chance on Thursday night. And this could be a pretty good rain. As we take a look at future cast, this is showing it uh, kind of setting in through the overnight hours, getting heavy through the daytime hours. There's a slight risk of severe weather the way it's set up, but a greater risk of some flash flooding because of all the rain of late. And this rain could go on all the way into, uh, well, Friday morning. And some of the forecast models are kicking out two and a half to three and a half inches of rain from it. That's later on the week. Let's enjoy the couple of dry days and then the big rain. And after that, only scattered thunderstorms in the forecast Friday and Saturday. Dry on Sunday. And so begins a run of 90 degree weather on Sunday. We